The second type of jumping kick involves a one-two action in which the rear leg comes up to provide momentum and then while in the air, there's a shift to the other leg and that's the leg that does the kick. So if we start off one-two with the jumping front kick, notice, knee up, goes, bang, do that again. That's the easy one. Now we proceed to a little bit tougher one, which is turning into the round kick. The start is exactly the same. There's the turn. And the key thing is allowing the body to turn all the way sideways so you get some punch into that kick. Now the hardest one, actually, is the one-two action on the side kick. Now watch this again because as she picks up her kicking leg, notice how her whole body turns sideways. And to do that kind of shift in midair is a little bit tough, but notice how she turns all the way, bang, the kick comes in. And the landing, bang, hands are up. Now, if you're little and skinny like I was, when I was 14 years old, starting karate, then you can also work on achieving height. But these particular kicks, the second series, are more of a momentum-based type of thing. So you're throwing body mass and speed, which the two of those together create momentum, so that you can add that to the power of the legs and the kick.